Hello and welcome back. This is Ashkol Rafi once again. In this video, I'm going to show you how to work on a lead generation and web research project. Especially, I'm going to show you how to find email addresses of specific targeted LinkedIn profiles by using a Google Chrome extension. So as you can see, I have got this spreadsheet where I have got few hundreds of people's database. Now I have to verify their employment status. If these people are currently working on these companies, if they are working on these companies, then I have to collect their current job title, their email address, and then I have to collect their LinkedIn profile URL. So without further ado, let me take you to the steps and let me show you how to do the verification and then how to complete or achieve their uh, title, email and LinkedIn profiles. So first of all, we have to copy this domain and this name. So I'm going to hit on shift and after that, I'm going to click here and then I'm going to click here and I'm going to copy both of these uh, data points. After that, I'm going to take you to a new tab. I'm going to paste and search for this information on Google. And after that, you are going to see that this is the LinkedIn profile. So let's verify the LinkedIn profile and the verify the status of the person's employment with that company. So if you just notice here, this is the person we are looking for. This guy is currently working at this company. Uh, and we are looking for uh, a match with 500px.com so let's just see his uh, experience or the job histories from here and just take a look 500 pixels or px is available here and this guy left the company on march 2018 so he's currently not working with the company so we can simply make an update status here uh, no longer working all right and after that we have to go for the next profile so i'm going to copy again the domain name and the person's name so i'm going to copy them and let's go to this google search tab i'm going to paste the information hit enter and you are going to see that the first profile here it is appearing so i'm going to open this up to verify if this is the person we are looking for now yeah just take a look says w o h n s says w o h n s here and he's from agolo.com just take a look ceo at agolo.com so this is the correct profile we are looking for so now i'm going to copy the url linkedin profile url i'm going to paste it right here after that i'm going to update the job title which is going to be ceo and here you go now I am going to update the status and then we have to collect the email address so to collect the email address we are going to use a google chrome extension named kando so i'm going to make a search here let's say kando email finder and just take a look here is the google chrome extension i'm going to open the link in a new tab and here is the extension page i'm going to attach this link into the video description for your easy access now after visiting this page simply you have to click on this add to chrome button right here and then let's click on add extension button and within like seconds this tool is going to be added to your chrome browser and after that it is going to take us to its official page now we are going to click on this go to linkedin and try it and here we go it is just populating the bill gates profile and if you just notice we are seeing a pop-up appearing here so now after installing this tool we have to sign up for a free account on this um, software or let's say on this extension to do this simply click on this login or sign up button right here and it is going to show you your email addresses gmail addresses specifically now i'm going to sign in with this gmail account and here we go just take a look plan is free we have settled our free account and we have got 100 remaining credits for your current cycle that means we are going to be able to collect 100 people's email addresses so now we are done with the account setup now what we have to do we have to reload this page of this person and after that we are going to see that there will be some emails or data populating including the personal email address and the professional business email address so now if i click on this get info just take a look we are seeing the personal email and the professional email that's an awesome tool right 
So now what I'd love to do, I'd love to copy this data from here. If we just click here, it is going to be copied. Now let's go back to the spreadsheet. After that, we are going to paste the information here. So this is uh, the personal email. So we can simply add another tab here, personal email and business email. If some client needs personal email, you can provide them as well. You will find some jobs where these uh, informations people are looking for. And if you are curious about knowing if the email is valid, just take a look whenever I'm hovering over, it is populating this profile picture. So there is no way it, this email is wrong, right? So this email is 100% accurate. Now let's just go back to the profile and we are going to collect the business email. Let's copy it. We are going to here and then I'm going to paste the information right here. Oops, not the phone number. I am looking for email address. So let's go back, paste it. And here we go. We have got the personal email and the business email for the first lead. Now the same process, I'm going to try this contact. I'm going to copy this link from here or actually these informations. After that, I'm going to make it paste and search for this business domain name and the person's name. After that, just take a look, we are seeing ban macros from uh, some other companies, but I am seeing this company name as well. So I guess this is the profile. So I'm going to open this link in a new tab. And now we can cross them out from here. And if you just notice here, ban Marcus, we are going to verify, just take a look, co-founder of ERM, ER map, right? So this is the profile we are looking for again. And I'm going to copy this URL from here. Let's copy this one. And we are going to paste it here. We are going to update the current job title at this company. So we are going to update it like, here we go. Then I'm going to copy this, paste it here. And then if you just notice, this is a personal email address. So I'm going to click on this get info button right here and just take a look, we are going to get this email address. So now I'm going to copy the email by simply clicking here. The email is has been copied. Now I'm going back to the spreadsheet and putting the information right here. And just take a look, this email is also 100% valid email. And just take a look, match with the profile picture. All right. So this is how I'm going to verify one thing. I didn't find the business email for this person this way. So what we can do, we can simply make another Google search. So let's see if we can find any email address from here. Control F at the rate and let's see. Your map. Okay. Oops. I think I found something here. So I'm going to open this link in a new tab and nothing. Okay. All right, so let's go. All right, so now if I, where is the name? What is the name actually? Ben Marcus, so I'm going to type out Ben Marcus. And I'm seeing the name here, Larry at the rate airmap.com. So let me just see Benjamin D. Marcus. So Larry is not his name. So in this case, we can simply copy these things again, first name and last name at the rate. And after that, I'm going to copy the domain name from here, paste it and hit enter. Let's see if we can find any email from here. No emails, no problem. So we can actually verify the emails by putting them on gmail.com. And after that, let's put it here. And just take a look, ban at the rate ermap.com is the accurate email address for this person because we are seeing the profile picture appearing, right? And if you just match this person's uh, face, you are going to see a close match here. So this is the process that you can follow to do lead generation for your clients. And I have shown how easily we can get a good information or a whole lot of information about the email address collection by using the free Kando tool. So um, and one more thing I'd love to show you, if I open up any of these profiles, you are going to see that how many credits you have got left here. It is going to populate. Let's just take a look. We have got two, uh, we have revealed email information for two contacts. So now we have got 98 credits. And if you click on this more button right here, if you visit dashboard, 
you are going to find additional informations here about your usage so okay manage your leads i'm going to click here you're going to find how many leads you have collected and just take a look we have got three valid emails and two were personal one was work so if you want you can download this data from here as well simply click here it will be select all of them then export them to csv xlsx or json as per your client's need or you can simply share this profile uh, page url or spreadsheet url with your client so this was the process i believe you have found this video helpful if you did please please give this video a like share this video to help your friends let me know your opinion by commenting below i hope to see you in my next videos have a good day